girl Queen Naja. Thank you guys for watching. Great to be here. So let's keep it going, man. We got to talk about um, the irrelevant city girls. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm just so tired of them. Girl, go, girl, go do something. Because cause rapping ain't it. All right. But anyway, shout out to the info spot for the post. <clears throat> JT did an uh, interview with Paper Magazine, y'all. And she talks about her, uh, you know, pretty much the fall, the demise of the city girls. Okay. Um, it says JT reveals she was depressed over City Girls' low album sales for their third studio album, Raw. Uh, I is quote, I was like, oh my god, it's effing over, and then no bars went viral again. That song got me through a lot. It will always be special to me. All right. She's saying, uh, yeah, the city girl, I mean, the city girls was never good to me. I'm sorry, y'all. All right. You said it was giving what it was supposed to give, right? Right. Like it, it was it was never it to me. It was never it. I, I don't know what the heck is going on. But look, she says, uh, one time I remember being really depressed about our record sales. JT recalls she is referring to the October 2023 release and underwhelming uh commercial performance of Raw. Um the uh the third studio album by the City Girls, which triggered a wave of online mockery when it was uh projected to sell between six to eight thousand units in the first week. That's I think I can sell more albums than that. God, that's trash. They went double styrofoam in the hood. Y'all went aluminum. Okay, y'all went a uh, bubblegum rapper. It says, uh, she says, I was like, oh my God, it's effing over. Um, I'm sad that it's not even on my debut project, but I feel like it did what it had to do to uh, to get me uh, to where I'm at today. Uh, man, girl, you just trying to stay relevant. That's all it is. That's why you got all this beef with uh, Cardi B and uh, Sukiana, all these people. And I don't think she still didn't uh, reply to Sukiana, did she? She replied online on Twitter in a Twitter rant, but she didn't rap back. Remember, Sukiana came out with that cocaine song, you know? You said, I never was able to get into them. I, I don't blame you. I, I don't blame you. All right? I don't know what the hell is going on. Trash. Trash. And that leads into this. Apparently, she came out with a new song Throwing shots at Cardi B and nobody care, y'all. It says JT seemingly shades Cardi B in her new track, Lemon Pepper. Quote, these Rick Owens, uh, boo, these ain't prison pants. Used to be the ish. Look at that B flopping now. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, because Cardi B, her music ain't been hitting like that lately. Okay, and she ain't dropped that album. Which gonna lead into what we got to talk about tonight with her and Joe Button. All right, you said that Joe, yeah, that song was Buns. Yeah, that, yeah, that, yeah. I, I believe you. You talking about this song? I don't want to play it. Hold on. Ask him for a bag and his replies always okay. Yeah. Oh my, we don't want to hear that. Cardi B says Hot Ish debuted higher than any song you ever dropped or been on Prison Pants. <laughs> she called her Prison Pants. Uh, JT prison pants, JT prison pants, JT prison pants, JT prison pants. All right, you, girl, you need to focus on working, uh, flipping burgers at the Krusty Krab, okay, and not annoying Squidward, okay. That's what you need to focus on, other than making music, all right? I'm sorry. All right? You said Cardi thinks she's Rihanna? Yeah, I don't know why. Rihanna Rihanna didn't drop so much classics and so many albums for her to... So, to where though, it's okay for her not to drop an album. Same thing with uh, Mariah. Mariah dropped all of those classics and then hit us with the emancipation, the emancipation of Mimi. She don't even got to make music no more. And then came back years later with the, Why are you so obsessed with me? Right? All right. And then hit you with the uh Christmas song. Okay. Cardi B that came out with one album in eight years and got the nerve to be acting like she Beyonce or something. 
He said she about to drop that baby right. Instead of dropping that damn album, JT needs to t take time and work on herself and get therapy. She need to do something. She need to do something. But yeah, uh, she said hot-ish debuted higher than any song you ever dropped or been on. Prison pants. Everybody has good and bad moments, but you acting, uh, but you haven't been, uh, haven't had one since what? Act up, right? And that was in what? 2017, 2018. Um, uh, uh, Cardi B says, matter of fact, I'm not even doing this on the timeline. It's becoming real repetitive for your doggy treats. Uh, we already addressing it uh, in the DMs. Goodbye, y'all. JT says, wait, I'm back for this uh, last tweet because. Who doing anything for doggy treats? If anything, Glorilla have you a, a ooh gave you a bone that you need to feed uh, to the dog you was posing by the pool with for hot ish fancy pants. Uh oh, uh oh, the T is ten. Um, but I mean Cardi B, you got some nerve, and JT, you have the the audacity. Okay. You only relevant right now for I don't even know why because you dating Uzi, uh she be too busy trying to make sure off cheat ain't uh with some floozy. Hey man, let that man cheat in peace. JT, let's be honest. Uh, Cardi helped uh put the city girls on. I don't understand. Yeah, to a certain extent, I remember that twerk song. I remember that twerk song, but it was really that act up song, the song that uh Lil Yachty uh wrote. But yeah, you right that that twerk song was big for them. That twerk song was uh, big. You said that fussy smell uh, like uh, collard greens. Everybody knows. Oh, my Lord. Put a helicopter in the chat. That's crazy. That's crazy. But let's keep it going. Let's keep it going. We got to talk about y'all favorite, man. Y'all favorite pregnant woman that don't want to claim that she pregnant for some reason. Because she embarrassed. Because uh, off... Uh, what y'all call him? Off cheat, off cheat over here, living his best life. Let that man cheat in peace, y'all. Let that man cheat in peace. All right. Shout out to Hot New Hip Hop for the article. All right. It says, uh, Cardi B cheekily uh, addresses pregnancy rumors and trolls fan speculation. Man, girl, ain't no speculation, girl. You pregnant? Let me see. Cardi B pregnant UK. Hold on. Cardi B pregnant UK. Uh pregnant UK. Y'all seen that? Cardi B She was just in the UK, y'all. She lucky we can't find it. I hate when they do this. She was in the UK looking pregnant as ever. Hold on. Cardi B. Was it England, y'all? Remember, we just covered this last week. I ain't gonna lie. Twitter's, uh, what's it called, y'all? Twitter's, like, search engine is trash. The search engine is trash. Yeah, I can't find it. But yeah, she was uh she was at Disneyland, man, looking pregnant as ever with offset. Hold on, pregnant. Let me put a Cardi B pregnant. She's been pregnant so many times already in rumors and stuff, so it's hard because other stuff always popping up. Um Yeah, man, stuff coming up from her last pregnancy, man. Dang. Uh, yeah, this this is Cardi B uh in England talking about she not pregnant. All right. Really? Good to see you, Cardi. Are you pregnant again? No, no, no. Really? Good to see you, Cardi. Are you pregnant, Cardi? Are you pregnant again? No. 
Really? On va s'arrêter dans un moment. Je vais te suivre, Cardi. Are you pregnant, Cardi? Are you pregnant again? No? Are you pregnant, Cardi? Cardi? No? No? Um. Yeah, that, that's when she was out there, but I was looking for her when she was walking, y'all. She was waddling. Yeah, look, we got the pictures right here. She was at Disneyland in Paris. That's where it was at, Paris. Paris. You trying to tell me this woman don't look pregnant? It's given pregnant. It's given maternity. It's given maternity leave. Are you pregnant, Cardi? Are you pregnant, Cardi? All right. No, no, really? So I got to put Disney. Y'all said Disneyland? Yeah, she was at Disneyland in Paris. Hold on, Paris. Cardi. Uh-oh, man. Cardi B is just responding to everybody, y'all. All right. Apparently, uh, she cussed out the girl named Paris that's on uh Twitter. She she be going viral and stuff. She kind of big on Twitter. Look at um, look at this chick. She says, uh, why does Cardi B feels she's above criticism? All of her peers are dropping albums and doing progressive things in uh their career, and she sticks out like a sore thumb. No tours, no meet and greets, no merch. One album, feature singles, and uh viral moments. Is she a rapper or does she just rant? She said, that's not what I said. F you and your three stomachs, B. Dang. Dang. Hey, Cardi B need a uh Cardi B need a um need a podcast at this point. Cause that's that's all she be doing. She just be going on rants. All right. She just be going on rants. All right. Dang, man. Cardi B be doing way too much. This is her responding to people calling her pregnant. All right. You see why I be violating? Let me tell you why I be violating. Because it be certain shit. It be certain shit that y'all just y'all just take it too much, and then y'all be like, "Oh, I'm sorry, mother." I'm. So- Let me tell you something. If your shit is called whatever the fuck, boy, I don't know what the fuck your fucking Instagram, Twitter name is. If your shit is whatever the fucking boy, be a boy. You see, but delusional girl bird again doing too much. Why the fuck? Let me tell you something. My body, my choice, my titties, my pussy, my feet. Mind your fucking business. You a whole fucking boy. I don't give a fuck if you take dick more than me, bitch. You're not me. You're not a bitch. So stop fucking worrying about the fuck I got going on. Then when I fucking violate, it's like, I'm sorry, mother bitch. I'm not your mom. And stop fucking playing stupid. And then when I go off, it's like, oh, uh, you see why? Is it that necessary? Yes, it's necessary. Because one tweet is enough. Then you do another tweet. And you think motherfuckers going to play with you. And I'm going to remind y'all. I don't give a fuck if you a fan. I don't give a fuck if you got my fucking picture on your shit. Be a boy. Be a fucking boy. And get out my fucking pussy. You see how the, hey, this is how the celebrities are. She sound like Chris Sean. I mean, dude, dude, I mean, I, y'all know I call her an unstable creature too. Cardi, I told you, there's no difference between Cardi B and Chris Sean. Don't this sound very familiar? Yeah, because right, everybody came to watch me and I didn't even get to play. I fucking right, hate back. these weird ass fans I got. I hate y'all. Y'all really be finding me and shit. I ain't. Y'all cool, but y'all ain't that cool. Don't don't keep up with me like that. I ain't that famous, okay? I'm famous, but don't treat me like that. It's scary. Like- I don't give a fuck what nobody say at this point. Real shit. Like. Even my fan pages tag me and what they want to see from me and all this other shit. I want to see this from you. I want to see that from you. I don't give a f- what the f*** you want to see, bro. Y'all are some irrelevant people. I mean, thank you for following me. Thank you for supporting me. But stop being weird. Like, I'm obligated to listen to y'all motherfuckers because I don't know none of y'all, bro. I don't give a f- about none of y'all, my- if I was to keep it a bean, y'all keeping up with me. 
not keeping up with nobody that's in my DM saying, oh, I think you should try this. I think you should try. I'm not trying. <laughs> I'm going to keep running this back. <laughs> Is you geeking for? I don't know. It sound that Cardi B don't sound no different than what Krishan was saying. And, and and I guess this is just uh somebody saying that, you know, one of her fans uh you know saying that she uh saying that she's pregnant by offset, you know, after uh after he was cheating, you know. Stop playing. I be letting shit slide, 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 slide. If y'all catch me in a fucking bad mood, I'm going to fucking eat you the fuck up. Because leave me the fuck alone. Stupid bitch. I don't know, man. How, how does Zesty community feel about that? The uh, the rainbow. I don't know. I don't know if they go like that. I don't know if they go like that. But yeah, I'm, I'm mad that I couldn't uh, find the footage because we wanted to see her waddling. That 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 lady was waddling, y'all. She was looking pregnant, pregnant. All right, look, Cardi B, Disneyland. Um, you see, we just keep finding pictures. She she looked pregnant, y'all. I don't know why she lying. I think she just embarrassed. All right, I I, I, th I think she just embarrassed. I think she just embarrassed, y'all. It is what it is, though, G girl. Hey, hey, living your truth. That's your husband. That's your man. My man. My man. My man. My man. My man. My man. That's your man. That's your man. So uh, I think you should just uh. You know, swallow your pride and just embrace the new baby that's coming. Because I don't think that's... You, oh, we got it. Let's go. Uh, you can't tell me this girl ain't waddling. This girl waddling like a damn penguin, y'all. Waddle, baby. Waddle, baby. Waddle, waddle. <laughs> Not wobble. Remember the song Wobble? Wobble, baby. Wobble, baby. Wobble, baby. <laughs> drop, drop it like it's hot. Drop it like it's hot. Wobble, 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 wobble. No, it's waddle. Waddle, 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 la <laughs> waddle like it's hot. All right, she over here waddling, y'all, like a damn penguin. All right. No picture. No picture? Come on, man. Girl, she, she was waddling, y'all. I got women in the chat telling me that she pregnant. <laughs> Okay, so I know I'm not tripping. All right, so it says uh, a simple spelling error might have just caused Cardi B to confess. But the more likely scenario is that the fans are the ones being trolled here. Cardi B fans are demanding answers when it comes to her rapid pregnancy rumors, which have uh, really skyrocketed over the over the past few weeks. However, a simple spelling error might have caught fans in a, a bit of a tough position. And even if it was uh, an intentional meme reference, um, it's now it's now hard to tell who's being unserious. Moreover, a fan uh, asked her, hey, Barty, are you uh, are you pregnant? Uh, to which she responded, no, I'm not pregnant. Uh, as such, now fans uh, are wondering whether the Bronx MC is pregnant rather than pregnant. Man, is, is this something to even... Uh, uh, like this was a slow news day or something. Why the hell is y'all even like? You know what I'm saying? Why y'all reporting on this? All right. It says, however, it's far from the only social media interaction of Cardi B that caused some uh social media speculation as of late. While discussing the uh still debated release of her sophomore album, she suggested that albums aren't performing well in the summer. Many interpret it as a shot 
against frequent collaborator Megan Thee Stallion. Wow. Which will be a quite a surprising beef. But the mother of two dismissed the notion online. So it seems like she just spoke generally on the industry and might interpret Megan's modest smash as just a factual uh, de development, not something to diss Meg over. Okay. This is crazy. Yeah, man. Um, I don't care what she says. She pregnant. Allegedly. Allegedly. I ain't Tasha K, y'all. I ain't got no money. Allegedly. Allegedly. You said 4th of July, she was out with her uh with her uh with her uh <laughs> with her uh belly out. Um this is crazy, man. You said at the uh you said at the end of the day, it's your husband bad. Or a uh, good you you claim it right. Yep, the belly round. This is all women that got uh kids, huh? I have four children. I know a, a pregnant waddle, right? She does she does look to be waddling with a purse bigger than her. That purse is fire though. Okay, okay. You said why she's so sensitive? Yeah, happy feet. Yep, that's the movie. Happy feet. All right, looking like she should be in uh, ice age, having her 20th child trying to hide it, right? crazy y'all